Okay, guys, we have Brandon with us now. Um, where, where are you? Hey, on camera, lah. don't be shy. Come on, come on. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. Hey, yeah. I need to pin myself also. Pin myself. Uh, I pin. Hey, okay, uh, yeah, guys, uh, first of all, can you welcome Brandon? Yeah, Brandon purposely take time off to, to, to have this short uh, chit chat session with you guys. Okay, if you have any problem, uh, okay, now, now, yeah, Brandon followed me for seven months. Okay, Brandon followed me for seven months. Uh, he scored how many A? Uh, 11th grade age. Uh, yeah, he's got 11 A's. He's from Chongling, Penang. Guys, if you if you did come for my, I think, last two classes, I did mention Chongling is one of the top schools without a single doubt. Without a single doubt. So, uh, Brandon, this is informal. I don't need to feel pressure one, yeah? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Um, now, based on last few sessions, what I did with, uh, what I did with the other, uh, other students uh, who joined the session, uh, uh, I have gathered like a lot of questions. Already. One of the things that I think students now want to know is, um, what's your routine? What's your routine? Like, like um, your study schedule and how you go about certain subjects. Lah. Maybe you can share them. Uh, so uh, I start with my uh, study routine first. Lah. Yeah, so uh, basically, I while during preparing my SPM, I start uh, studying on around uh, 9 a.m. After my breakfast, I start I start studying around 9 a.m. and after that, I will do uh, studying, do my revision for about uh, three hours like that until 12 something. Then I will eat my lunch and have some rest. Then after that, I will continue for about another three hours like that and have a break, then eat. Well, three hours non-stop, ah. Uh, yeah, for me, it's three hours non-stop. Oh, very good, eh? Very good, eh? Uh, normally boys have the problem backside cannot sit long. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> but then also, to to have uh after that another three hours. Then after that uh I have some tea break, eat something uh, and relax a while. Then after that I will study until around six o'clock. Then I will uh play piano a while. Okay, oh, uh, yeah. By the way, he, piano is his reward system. Piano is his reward system. Every one of us have a reward system. One like me was back then. Uh, more to sports lah. More to sports. If not music, if not then uh, a bit of computer games lah. Four, 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 five, I don't play much games really. Uh, okay. I want to mention one thing uh. guys. If you came for the normal class earlier, just now Ravina said, uh, near exam, she studied three hours morning, three hours hours noon, three hours night. So Brandon also same thing, uh, nine hours. Correct, uh? Brandon? Yeah. Nine hours. Uh? No, no, actually more than that, because uh, after dinner, I also did study. Nine hours, no? Morning, night, uh, morning, three, noon, three, then three at night. Uh? No, night, uh, night, after night, after dinner, I was first study until uh, midnight. Oh, even longer, guys. Even longer. Okay, they want to know uh, how about schooling days because now they are going to school. I mean, they are joining the Zoom classes. Uh. So, uh, for uh, school days, of course, uh, morning uh, we'll follow all the school teachers' class. Then, uh, after that... Do you really pay attention? Do you really pay attention? <laughs> to be honest, some. Some lah. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> To be honest, right? then uh, then after that, uh, after uh, the school dismissed, I will have lunch, and after that, we'll study start uh, start studying around two thirty. Uh. Oh, oh, this one is a good question. How do you avoid burn out studying so long? Yeah, because I think your studying your studying slot is very long, two three hours, two three hours. How do you avoid burn out? Means how do you stay motivated? How do you not be distracted? Uh, because mostly, uh, well, during study, I'm not just uh, just studying and memorizing myself. But mostly, 
uh, a lot of my friends will ask, uh, send some questions to the party questions to ask me and uh, I will help them. So through this, I will study also, just not in like uh, keep memorizing, keep reading, but I study through teaching my other friends. Do you have study group? Uh, just my, no, how to say, uh, just uh, among my friends, huh? not few, uh, a few outside close other, one, uh. Yeah, a few close ones. Guys, I think you can have a few friends, good ones to, uh, like, 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 you know those that can really study one because problem is sometimes in a group when one person say something like, hey, you know that girl start to date that boy, then a lot of gossip, like, a lot of gossip come, uh, you cannot study D1. You end up talking about the gossip than the sejarah, the Mesopotamia. So I think you, if you all guys want to find a study buddy, study partner, get one or two who are more serious in study. Don't ask your friend who always play computer games study with you. Don't do that. Yeah, and there's a good question here. Uh, how many months did you start this nine hours studying? How long uh, did you start this nine hours study? Bef uh, before my trial. Before your trial, la. Yeah. Guys, you should do it now, Edile. <laughs> <laughs> how many hours of sleep Brendan how many hours of sleep how many hours of sleep so uh, for weekdays mostly I will sleep uh, on around 11 and wake up on 7 yeah, very good number of hours yeah. 12, 1, 2, yeah. uh, 8 hours so yeah, but for weekend, if there's no uh, online class for weekend, I will sleep around uh, 1 a.m. or 2 a.m. and wake up at the same time also, around 7. I think weekend. as a student, you need at least 7 hours of sleep. Right? At yeah. least 7 hours and maybe noon time 1 hour sleep. Cannot be longer than 1 hour, the noon one. I, I believe in afternoon nap one. Uh, yeah, this one is a good one. How do you study sejarah? This is one of the questions the, the previous slot get a lot. How you tackle sejarah? Okay, uh, just for sejarah, for uh, satu, the paper one, the objective question, just uh, for paper one, you don't need to memorize much, just to uh, do a lot of the past year. Hey, they are format different from yours. Ah. <laughs> But the, the syllabus is completely different or what? Because Sorry? you can choose like, but even even though the syllabus is different, you can uh, may, maybe find the topics that, that are similar. Then because there might be recycled questions, the topics oh, might, oh, that yeah. are similar. I, I think that's for all the subjects. Uh. Confirm got overlap one. Oh, oh, sejarah no leh. Oh, but, but, I'm not but, similar but, but at all. Go. Biophysics, chemistry, okay. Biophysics, chemistry, confirm what? So, uh, for Sujara, the if like that for the paper two, uh, you especially for the paper two, the KBAT questions, KBAT questions, you need to write uh a lot and read more, read more news and more different articles, get more knowledge, because mm. like uh because uh they need. The answer scheme is not fixed for k bus question uh, sejarah, but uh, they need you to have a uh, permikiran matang. But need what do you normally refer? Reference book or textbook? Because like just now, the earlier slot, um, she refers to textbook 100%, not even reference book. Are you like? Because uh, for sejarah, uh, of course, for the question in the syllabus, I will refer to textbooks. But uh, for the k bus questions, uh, I will like uh, refer more to the news or the latest decision uh, by the government. So I, I read a lot of the news and articles to know more about this. Means you need to write a lot of the latest facts inside your answer to show that you are a more mature candidate. Means they want mature answers. La. Yeah. They want yeah. mature answers. La. Yeah. So like, Okay, okay. Uh, you support your answers with facts. With a lot of facts. I think format-wise, KSSM, how are anyone who knows uh, like, like format actually compared to Brandon's time, like difference a lot. The factor I think changed completely. La. Same but not paper three. Oh, like bio like that, la. like bio physics chemistry. La. 
how do you juggle studying nine hours and tuition? No, I think the first question is this. Many were asking, how about homework? Because um, I'm guys, he's from SMJK Chongling. I believe homework crazy one. Yeah, uh, sometimes it's quite quite a lot the uh, homework. Yeah. Uh, can I be honest? <laughs> I'm a bit afraid to answer that. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you don't do one. Uh, you don't do one. Uh. <laughs> because I think everyone here knows that sometimes uh, doing homework doesn't help. Uh. Yeah, yeah. Time even. It's a waste of time even. I don't, I also don't do homework. Uh. Yeah. Okay, then what else uh, just now they talk about? Oh yeah, do you plan your studying schedule? Do you plan or not? You mean like uh, one day I'm going to study what subject like that? Yeah, can be for the day, can be for the week. So uh, actually, I, I would just uh, plan the time. Just like just now what I say, the three hours, three hours like that. Ah, then, uh, you plan then, what to study uh, the three hours, three hours, three hours. Uh, then uh, I will just plan the time, but I will not plan like uh, what subject should I study. Because oh. like, uh, how to say, every day I have different mood. Like today I'm, I want I like to study Sejera tomorrow. I want to do some math. Then next day I want to study bio. So I just depends on that day uh, what I want to study. Just depends on my mood. That's the normal class is not micromanaging your day. Micromanaging. You plan one month, it's the big picture. The small picture is whereby day to day basis. What yeah, yeah. Do? I think need two la. need two one. Need two one. Uh you got how many how many A plus? Uh? How many A plus you got? A plus A, A seven, seven A plus two A two A minus. Uh then what uh Megan asked, is your result same to your Pachubaan? Same with your Pachubaan. Uh, my Pertubaan, I get uh, 8 A plus and 3 A, for, uh, according to my the forecast result. No, no, don't forecast it. Eh? You don't forecast it. Eh? Uh, because uh, our school didn't, how to say, we don't have a specific grade for a marks like that. So, oh, I see, I see, see, I see, we I just see. see forecast. For trial, we uh, just see the marks only. Uh, guys, they are here, right? Brandon's here, Pachubaan is not so not so important because not all schools got take, you know. Not all schools got take Pachubaan. I, I know students whereby they take one subject, two subjects, some never even take at all. So his year is different. Uh, what he mean by forecast is they will teachers will up your grade. Whatever you get in Pachubaan, they will up your grade. So so that you can use it to apply for your university. Lah. That's called forecast result. Uh, but in actuality, uh, if your results is straight A's in Pachubaan, uh, I have confirmed your SPM 90% are uh, you straight A, D1. That's why I keep telling everyone, uh, uh, your Pachubaan is damn important. Because if your Pachubaan, you score like crap, I know your SPM not too far. Uh, normally, la, normally. La. Yeah. Uh, then there's the next question. Uh, how do you motivate yourself? How I motivate myself? Just, uh, just like uh, just now as what I mentioned the, about like the the piano the reward. So mm -hmm. like after I study after some time, then I can play piano. That uh, because uh, that's my interest. So I after I something you like, I, yeah, yeah, and uh, other than that, when um, uh, I'm whenever I'm having lunch or tea break or dinner, I will watch some uh the programs I like. Uh. So for this also for me to relax myself and feel more energetic after eating and can. Uh boys study. he's talking about maybe Netflix and uh, not other thing you're thinking. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how long before SPM you study so intense? Yeah, uh, which question? Uh, oh yeah, Brandon, before that, before that, I want to ask you, uh, just now I asked yeah. Ravina the same question. Were there times you felt demotivated? Uh, 
to be honest, actually no. Wow. Okay. Okay. Wow. You're a special case. You're yeah. A special because, case. Uh. Because uh, I don't know whether you still uh, remember I did the state paper, the Google Drive for uh, the SPI, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah. I, 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 I remember, I remember. Yeah. Guys, he is, yeah, 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 yeah. He's a special case. He's always motivated. Guys, you know why? Because uh, he created a WhatsApp group. He motivate his friends. He, he, he keep motivating people on social media even one. Yeah, he's a special case, uh, guys. Yeah, this one you don't follow, uh, This one is uh, yeah. Then because uh, other than actually other than the step paper Google Drive, I do I did another class Google Drive for my own class. So I'm the one who motivate my class from the day to night every day. Yeah, guys, that's what he does. He he'll put like uh, uh guys, come on, there's one more paper. This and that. He's he's that he's uh he's a leader la. He's more of a leader la. Yeah, he 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 likes to lead the way la. Um. Okay, no, the he's a mother. No, 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 no. Yeah, I know he got mother. I, he's a mother. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how long before SPM you study so aggressive? The question was. Uh, I think around three to four weeks like that. Three to four weeks. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, yeah. yeah. And before Petrubaan, that's what you mentioned. Uh. Yeah, and also before Petrubaan. Uh, guys, if you're Petrubaan, uh, do you know that the they, they earliest that they're going to school is September? Uh, when the earliest they're going to school is September. Yeah, yeah. So guys, if you're Petrubaan, it's September. You study like mad next month and August. September, go for your Petrubaan. After that, calm down. I mean, let go, let loose. Think back what you didn't do right. Then from there push one last time. I think I think you cannot push all the way. Did you push all the way until SPM? I cannot write. No, no, no. After the after the trial rest about that, after that, only continue uh, the revision for the SPM. Guys. The worst mistake you can make is you push like mad until Pachubaan, then you continue to push like shit. Confirm you break down one. Confirm you burn out one. Confirm, uh, no need to ask. Uh. Even Brandon also so motivated, need, need a break after Pachubaan. Hey, not easy, you know, he take 11 subjects. Why, uh? extra Mandarin and what? Uh? Uh, account. Oh, an account, wow. Wow, this is the best combo already. This is the best combo already. Extra one language and account. Wow. <laughs> Guys, you just imagine, if you're taking nine subjects now, take extra one Mandarin and one account. Oh. How was the Chinese paper? Easy. <laughs> the science paper was very hard. <laughs> as always, uh, as always. Guys, don't ask Chinese paper, yeah? This is motivation <laughs> session. <laughs> <laughs> how was accounts? Hey, actually, actually, I want to ask you also. Yeah, yeah. how was accounts? Uh, actually, account was uh, quite easy. Actually, account is a quite easy subject. So, uh, you just need to know the basic format of how to prepare the account then uh, even your answer uh, doesn't tally but if your steps are correct you still can get marks so you don't need to worry if even that your answer is not not tally so actually it's a quite easy to score subject uh okay okay um for those taking accounts i think not many la. i think not many la. uh for those taking accounts uh you mostly cannot inbound one you mostly cannot inbound one, <laughs> yeah, one yeah, yeah 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 uh, because even my top top student last time all also cannot inbound one. Oh, wow, sir cannot uh, cannot inbound one. but ju just just don't because you cannot inbound you think you cannot score because the like what he said the marks is in the steps okay so i've been hearing about accounts many many years ago. uh yeah we never touched on this wow surprisingly uh mx how you tackle mx uh, at math, actually, uh, I teach my class. I have oh. I uh, during uh the online learning because uh our school arranged the schedule, uh two pack and the teacher need to teach all the all the class. My teacher need to teach all her class all together, including those who are my class which is better and other class that might be weaker in at math. So my teacher will focus on the weaker class. Then I will. Uh, teach my class. Uh, I want to ask oh, you, uh, how, yeah. how big is your form? Uh? I never asked you this before. How big is your one tingkatan? Uh? 
How many students? Uh, 380 something. 380 something, guys. Big school. Mm. Uh. Chongling is... Chongling is big school. Uh. 380 something, how many classes? Uh, 14. 14 classes, guys. 14 yeah. classes. If you are from... If some of you are from Huanghua, it's something similar. It's something similar. If some of you are from SMJK Huanghua. SMJK schools are huge. SMJK schools are huge. You are in the first class, ah? Uh? Uh, actually, our school didn't arrange based on like the top in the one class or that. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Uh, so what do you recommend for admits? Let's say because like they can't teach their friends so much, so by themselves, how can they how can they study admits? What what should so, they do? Uh, because I did uh read some the of the KSSM admits syllabus before, and actually is. Most chapters are quite similar to our KBSM. I said there are some new chapters. Huh? Most chapters are quite similar. So actually you can take uh, SPM pass year as a uh, practice and also uh, state papers. Because actually most topics are quite similar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Differentiation, integration, all the same. Yeah, yeah. Function, function, all the same. Uh, how about yourself? You practice that? Uh? Yeah, I did do a lot of state papers. I the for MS I did uh the state papers for all states. A plus ah, huh? your MS A plus. Yeah, A plus. So guys, you can take this as a good tip, lor. When you prepare for MS, you do all the state papers for uh, all the question ah. Let's see what else. I think what quite good coverage eh? quite good coverage ah. Uh. Oh guys, by the way, he's going form six. Brandon is going form six. Uh, I think everything quite well covered. Uh, yeah, I think everything quite well covered. Maybe. Okay, guys. Any last questions? Uh, form six study long time a day. No, no, haven't entered yet. They haven't entered yet. Hey, when enter ah? Uh? I don't know yet. Not sure yet. Still waiting announcement. Some some say next month. Some say next month. Some say August. Eh. Any tips for physics? Uh, tips for physics, uh. because uh, I'm not sure how they are going to uh the examiner how the examiner going to mark is going to mark the question paper because uh actually I'm my physics is. To be honest, it's so so only, but I score based on uh, I score through answering techniques. It's surprising, ah, uh, your physics so so. Yeah, yeah. Surprising, ah, uh, my in yeah. in my my impression is you learn physics like like like, me not a plus book either. No way to not get a plus on it. Uh, I don't know. I keep getting this feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, as, oh, especially oh, oh. uh paper two, I score through. Uh, the answering, answering technique. Te- what do you mean yeah. by answering technique? Maybe you can share with them. Like uh, I'm not sure this is applicable to for this year, not but for my year is. You can write any answer you want as long as your answer uh didn't uh crash one one another means like uh they only one one answer but you can give more than one answer if two three four answers as long as all the answer didn't crash together. And anyone is correct then. Uh, you have marks. Oh, this one very risky. Eh, this one, I think guys, yeah, you better yeah. check your teacher. They're very risky. Eh. This is a very yeah, risky. Because thing. I'm not sure. I'm not sure whether this is applicable for them or not. But our year is allowed to be like to like. What that. he's trying to say is your final answer can have a few. Yeah, then they will choose oh, the correct one. Very You better check this one. This one a yeah, bit this, risky. Eh. Better, better confirm with the teacher. I I know moral can. I know moral can. Yeah, a moral of, can. Uh, a lot of students just stand by only. Just stand up only, and then karangan you make in one paragraph. So if they don't accept your this knee line, but if because all one paragraph they accept your knee line, so yeah. If you separate two karangan, they cannot accept. Uh, yeah, all, all these are uh, the answering techniques. Uh. So if you want to score in SPM, not just need, you not just need to study hard, but you need to know the answering techniques also. Problem is they never take exam even one time. Eh. Two years, they haven't taken even one proper exam. That's why I worry for them. It's better to co- confirm with the teacher, especially if they are 
the examiner or ketua pentaksi like that. So they they might know the marking format better. Yeah. Okay, guys. Any last question? Any last questions? Their 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 batch very different, you know. Your batch uh, is because exam stress. Yeah, like that. Their batch is no exam stress. <laughs> well, uh, they face a lot of different difficulties are compared to us. They don't have the enough reference, don't have enough past year, and everything is new. Everything is new. Resources got problem, exam problem, then yeah. mostly online. Yeah. How long, how long or hard for you? Why, wow, when you put a sentence like that. <laughs> uh, for long topic, how long you take to revise? I think this one very subjective. Lah. I think uh depends on which subject. Lah. If like uh, for Sejara, the long topic, to be honest, I just ignore it. Based on my syllabus, I, I will just ignore it. Because, because uh, how we say, uh, especially for paper two, we have, uh, our textbook has only 19 topics and only 13 topics will, be, will uh, come out in the exam. So, so you you're just, with your teachers. Uh. Yeah. yeah. So if for me, I just uh, skip one or two topics is okay. I, because I still have other questions to choose. What he's talking about is the answering technique. It is. Yeah, it's the answering technique also. How are you going to uh, start, she's uh, study? She's talking about chemistry, bio. I think I think I want to add in this one. Uh. I think guys, guys, I think to everyone here, um, I know that I mean to, to we are all we are, you're, you're all learning one, all of you are students one. So there will be topics whereby you've got no mood to study because uh it's very tough. It's like wow, it, like 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 you and the topic cannot click. So I think first step to go about it is uh, number one, uh, prepare mentally to tackle the topic. Number two, uh, don't try to settle everything in the day itself. Okay, I'm going to, let's say, for example, let's say value one of the topics, cell division, you're not too good. Give yourself time. Yeah, I'm going to study today and maybe next week one more time. Hopefully I get it. Don't, oh, today I want to settle everything. You will stress, you will stress out yourself. Huh? I think mentally quite important. Uh. Uh, a few keep, so, uh, I know not everyone taking Chinese, but uh, Brandon, many asking Chinese how, because you say Susa. <laughs> uh, for Chinese, actually, uh, my Chinese is not very good also. Uh. Uh, so I will just focus on the essay, the essay, the paper one, the essay, because mostly I won't understand the passage given in the paper two. And oh, guys, Brandon yeah. is a very, if you realize guys, I don't know how many of you are very sharp. Brandon is a very exam conscious student. Very exam conscious. If you realize uh, he tell you about paper one, he tell you about paper two, he tell you about paper one again and paper two. My previous session, nobody talked about any paper. Uh, it shows that he knows his formatting and what he's doing very well. You know that oh, every paper is like that. This is how I should do it. He, he knows very well how to go about the system. Maybe. Yeah, so this is the thing I realized about him throughout this chat, uh, which is more useful. Uh, he studies smart. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why he can tell you things like he studied this and don't study that. But if you do not know, guys, please study everything. <laughs> That's what I'm to tell. <laughs> so I follow Brandon. I don't study this and that. No, 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 no. You study everything. Yeah. <laughs> Okay lah, I think any uh, okay last one last one uh well, his name like Lee Chuhok eh. <laughs> <laughs> uh okay any tips BM Karangan I think this is a good one to end with uh. Uh, yeah uh for the BM Karangan actually it's quite for me it's quite similar to my uh Sudara paper too it means that I need to have a lot of the fakta to put uh uh inside to be put inside my uh, essay. How you prepare so, fakta to part? How you prepare fakta to part? I read uh, the news almost uh, every day to know about what's going on in the country. What has government decided? What uh, are there any new plans of the of by the government? The policy, yeah. Uh. yeah, the government policy. 
because uh, for me, I don't like to put those bombastic uh, words inside my karanga. For me, I don't like uh, to use those bombastic words. So I will more focus on the facts. Furry bahasa? Do you put a lot of furry bahasa? Uh, actually, not much. Maybe uh, just in my the kesimpulan, uh, the ending there will put one or two words. Uh, do you plan? Uh, do you do any essay plan for Karangan? Like what she's trying to say is, do you like write down beforehand these are the points mostly I'm going to use? Uh, I will write around before I start writing. I will write around three points first. And then I will think other one or two points when I'm writing. Then if suddenly I think about another point, I will write down again. In exam, ah, you're talking about in yeah. exam. Ah. Yeah. Uh, no, she's asking, do you pre-plan? Do you pre-plan? Oh no, no, no. I just walk in and write. Walk in and write, guys. Remember to walk in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, walk, walk in is very important. Walk in. <laughs> Uh, okay, uh, where do you find the, what do you read, newspapers or app or, I think app lah guys, app lah, no, this app video lah. Where do you read, they ask where you read the news? Uh, mostly I read it uh, from the media statement of ministry. I would know what, what they are doing but this is quite a weird thing for, for some of you. Yeah, no, where do people you. your age do that one? Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I really, I, I really sometimes I take some points from them. It, it's really a... Oh, you really take some points from them, guys. Wow, yeah, guys, yeah. I tell you. Yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. I, 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 guys, if, let's say you, I, I don't know, you got, you got any, uh, can try, not bad. Yeah, la, guys, I mean, I mean, can try out. La. Oh, this one is very different. They're on different level. Already. This one really different level. Already. If you realize, uh, guys, if you realize one thing, you never, or if you join any other earlier, earlier slots, uh, uh, he's just doing what is right to score. He's just doing what is right to score and trying to be a bit different from the rest. I think everything I'm hearing from him is quite different compared to all the other students because all the other students would be like, I read Sejarah textbook completely. MS, I practice uh, this one. He will tell you very specifically when Paper one, paper two, how uh, MS do all the last year's state paper, something like that. And Karang go and go and steal people's information from the ministry. Yeah. <laughs> okay, lah. Hey, hey, wow, we can really talk, eh? My God. Um, I think this is the first time we really talk like that. Yeah, but oh, only yeah, we message, yeah. ma. We message, we message. Yeah, I should yeah. him a lot in class one, guys. I should him damn lot in class one. Every <laughs> Hit about hit Brandon one every week since the first week. Uh. That's why when I ask him to come, I don't know whether he wants to come or not. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay, Brandon, thank you so much, guys. Can you say thanks to Brandon? Wow, oh, really, we can talk. Hey, really, uh, thanks, uh, Brandon. Uh. You are helping. Uh, you're welcome, welcome. Uh, uh, big deal. Uh. Uh, for me, most important is prepare uh, well, prepare well earlier. Really, you need to prepare earlier. And I think one week before SPM, I will just chill and relax. No, guys, you don't chill and relax. You study all the way. <laughs> so, I think, I'm, I think... I'm really quite chill and relax. Just not studying so hard until night already. Just uh, do some revision in the afternoon. Yeah. Like that. Actually, this is, uh, this is you are reviewing in your brain. Yeah. What is really going on uh, is you're reviewing in your brain. Am I am I okay or not? Am I ready or not? So um guys, there, there are students like that. They have studied so much, uh, they don't go all the way for exam, you know. They take one step down. Okay, let me check what I studied last time. Is it okay or not? If okay, then I just maintain it's replanning, it's called replanning, it's replanning. It's a good, yeah, it, it's it's supposed to be done one. You don't push like that until exam one. Never, never, never. Uh, guys, one last thing, you remember I told you, after every SPM paper with my school uniform on, I go and play basketball until everything wet. Yeah, then um, then only I go and bathe and then study for the next subject. You must know how to let go. Okay, okay guys, thank you. Thank you, Brandon. See you when I see you. Hey, thank yeah. you, sir. Okay.
拜拜。